Hello friends, thanks for stopping by. I hope you're all having a great day. Today I am going to talk to you about something that's going into pre-sale at Derm Store October 2nd. The actual ship date on this will be October 23rd, but from my understanding this sells out quickly. So I wanted to go ahead and get it out there today. Uh, I'm going to be talking about Harry Josh has a new blow dryer out and it is his ultra light pro dryer. This dryer is made in France and it's part of his, he has a whole line. I actually have uh, several things by him. I have his curling iron. Now I don't use a lot of hot tools on my hair, but um, I do have a couple of different curling irons and I will say this is one of my favorites. Uh, basically the reason why I like it, I think it's easy to handle, but it leaves such incredible shine. So, but we're not talking about this today, but I wanted to let you know that there are other things in the Harry Josh line. I have some brushes, I have his clips, I have his rat tail combs. Um, you know, I've had these things for quite a while. I don't really talk about them. I suppose perhaps I should, but, um, and everything comes in his signature mint green. I see it as mint green. But anyway, I've been happy with everything else. So uh, the blow dryer, as I said, it is going into pre-sale today. It comes in a beautiful box and that's what the inside looks like. And it says it's an ultra light pro dryer and it has, where is my zoom lens ladies? Here it is. Um, it is lightweight. It weighs less than one pound, which is really good for me because some blow dryers are a little on the heavy side. I mean, they have really improved them over the years, but um, I don't wear it on camera, but I wear a wrist brace most of the time because I have a nerve tendon problem throughout my wrist that runs from my elbow. And um, since taking on the doodle devils, uh, it has worsened for me. So blow drying my hair because it takes a little bit longer uh, does uh, prove to cause a little wear and tear on the wrist. So I usually wear a brace, but anyway, this dryer is a very, very light blow dryer. It does weigh less than one pound. Uh, I have been using it for three days now, three days in a row. I've blow dried my hair today. I did blow dry it. We'll talk about that in a minute. It also it has Whisper Soft technology. It's a patented silencer for quiet drying. And I will tell you, this is what it sounds like on. So it is very, very quiet, which I think really comes in handy if you have little ones that are napping. And you know, I have doodles that nap and I try to be very quiet. <laughs> anyway, it is very, very quiet. Here it is at its highest speed. So not a bad sound coming from the blow dryer. It also has quick dry time, blows air up to 94 MPH for less heat damage. And I will say that my hair took probably 12 minutes to blow dry with a round brush. Now I do rough dry first. And what I do, how I use this dryer or any other dryer is I will rough dry. Now, a lot of people say, oh no, 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 you should never do that. It just frizzes your hair out. If you rough dry in the direction that your hair is growing and you get most of the moisture out, that's what I mean by rough drying. It takes out at least 80 to 90% of the moisture. I do that on the highest speed, the hottest, and I just rough dry real quickly and that gets most of the moisture out. And then I will turn the dryer down and then I will start round brushing. So it doesn't take you as long because rough drying you can have done in a few minutes. Uh, and then it's, it's all the winding and curling of the brush that takes the longest time. So it, um, it does do a really good job at that. It also, it also has your ion technology, which adds volume or a sleek finish. Ion, ion will promote softness, smoothness, shine, no static. And um, you can turn it on or I had to find it. You can turn it on or off. Now, if you turn it on, you are promoting smoothness and shine. If you turn it off, you are promoting volume. So the way I use this is I will rough dry with it off 
And then when I am round brushing, I will turn the ion on for the smooth finish. Okay. And the shine. And of course, always ending with a cool shot, which this dryer also has will help to add even more shine. And it also helps to lock in the style. So if you're round brushing and you, you know, do it on the warm setting and then you give it a shot of cool air, it'll help to lock that shape around the brush. Okay. So you have more of a bend and volume to your hair. Okay. All right, let's see what else it has. Also energy efficient. It reduces energy consumption. The body it is lightweight, ergonomic design with curved handle for comfort and control. And I really do think it sits nicely in the hand. You'll notice the cool shot is right by your index finger. And then you have, you can work your thumb for any of the other um, buttons, dual ion function functionality adjust for sleek or voluminous styling. And I told you how I do that. And then of course, temperature control, it has three settings for maximum versatility. So when you turn it on, you'll see the red one. It, I have it on the highest right now. If you put it in the center, you have then gone to the warm, then you put it down one more and you're cooling it down a little bit. Okay. So it has three different settings, which I do like having on my blow dryer, because like I said, I do a rough with the warm, with the hot, and then I'll start in with the warm. And then when I have it on the brush, I can turn it down even more if I wanted to. And then again, the cool shot. Okay. So much to blow drying. <laughs> okay. And then of course it has the cool shot button. It has um, cool air flex device, additional patented nozzle, removable air filter, stainless steel filter ensures hair dryer runs efficiently, and a professional length cord of nine feet. Now this dryer is said to last up to at least 2000 hours. So if you're a professional, um, that's pretty good. And of course, if you're at home, this dryer should last you for a very long time. Now it does come with two nozzles and I'm using the longer one because the longer one gave me more, uh, the direction of the hair. It allows for more heat to go out in larger areas. And then of course we have our smaller one. Now I usually use a smaller nozzle, but I thought this was interesting. So I went ahead and used it and I really, I liked the way it worked. So, and it, it just pops on easily on and off. And that's what it looks like. Now it does have the screen in the back. I highly suggest to those of you who don't know this because a lot of people burn through blow dryers very quickly. You need to clean this screen. It collects dust, hair. So it just, it, I'm not sure if that, yes, it just pops right off and you just go ahead and give it a quick brush. You can even rinse it off and then just dry it and get all the dust off of it from time to time, at least once a month, my friends, and then it will last a little bit longer. And then this has little grooves and you just find the grooves that fit it and you pop it back on. Okay. But that is a very important part of a blow dryer is cleaning this out. Okay. So another thing I want to mention is it's very, very important when you're using a nozzle, you know, some people take it off and they blow dry their hair this way. You see these coils, they get extremely hot. When you're blow drying your hair around, your hair is flying all over the place. And if your hair touches that hot coil, you're going to singe your hair. So that's why a nozzle is so important because it, it not only directs the hair, the air flow, but it protects your hair. And also I believe the Harry Josh, for those of you who are my curly haired friends, I believe Harry Josh also has a diffuser. Um, and diffusers are great because they help to disperse the air even wider. And, um, you know, when you're blow drying curly hair, you want a diffuser so that you get a soft curl and not a frizz. All right. So I think I have covered pretty much everything about the blow dryer. And for those of you who don't really know who Harry Josh is, he is probably the most sought after editorial stylist there is. He's originally from Vancouver. He went to New York. He hooked up with Louis Vuitton and Mark Jacobs, I believe. And then in 2002, he got his really big break with Vogue magazine. <clears throat> and ever since, I mean, he started doing my, uh, my, and celebrities hair and he did it in his apartment 
and uh, they would call him for special occasions. I guess he's supposed to be a genius at styling the hair. So that's who Harry Josh is. Now the blow dryer does retail for $349 which may seem very expensive, but remember, it should last you with proper care and cleaning and not dropping it and just really taking care of things. I know when I spend a lot of money, I take care of things, but by cleaning the screen out and just really caring for your heat tools, you will get more use out of them. 2000 hours, it takes me, if it took me 15 minutes to blow dry my hair today, I've got four more days to go before I even equal an hour. So it really does last a very long time. So I guess it's just a matter of, it could be a great Christmas for, uh, gift, my friends. The blow dryer itself does go on pre-sale today, meaning that you can order it from Derm Store October 2nd. And then on October 23rd is the release date of it, although I'm sure there's many models and celebrities running around with it already. Um, Derm Store will then ship it out to you on October 23rd. And like uh, I said, this is the updated version to his original dryer, the Pro 2000. This is an updated version of it. So um, if you've already been using it, you know, in the comments, if you're using any of the Harry Josh tools, let us know what your um, experience has been with it. How long have you had your blow dryer? Is it still working pristine for you? Let us know in the comments. It might help somebody decide whether they want to go ahead and purchase something like this. But uh, for me, I've been very, very, very happy with it so far. I love how light it is. And today's hair is just blow dried with it. And I'm, you know, I just threw it up in a little rubber band here on the top. And um, my hair feels great. It doesn't feel dry. Um, we're having cooler weather. So the cooler weather means that uh, I get to enjoy frizz-free hair. Yes. Although I will say, uh, now today, what did I use as my shampoo? Of course, I used my Monet Renew. And then I used the Monet... Um, smoothing can no 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 i use the revitalize conditioner today so renew revitalize and i also i tried on my ends because i wanted to tone the hair down a little bit i tried the joico i think it's called golden chestnut shampoo so i just use that on my end i do that sometimes i use only monate on my scalp because monate i think is great for scalp health but uh, I like to use different masks and stuff, although I do like their masks, but I like to use different masks and things on the ends of my hair. So today I did use the Joico uh, Golden Chestnut, I think it's called. I'll have everything listed and linked below for you. Um, so you can go ahead and look and see, because I the Joico comes in several different shades. So if you're a redhead with fading, you might want to look into that. I sometimes like to, look at me, going off on a tangent. I sometimes like to find a mask that has a warm chestnut brown tone to it because I don't always like putting lots of dye, especially bleach, on my hair. So I will fill in a little bit with a, um, it's just a deposit shampoo. And because I wash, it comes out, so you don't have to worry about that. Some of them will last a little bit longer. There are certain brands that, you know, they will last a couple of shampoos, but I don't buy those because if you don't like the color, you don't want to walk around for a couple of days with it. But this one so far, it's just ever so slight the difference. Just something a little subtle. All right. All right. So thanks for stopping by. Don't forget, subscribe. We're anti-aging here. Be happy, healthy, beautiful, and most of all, my friends, lovable. I love you all. Bisous.